Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is Termux on a Chromebook Asus C302 Flip. Linux is not supported yet. That's why I'm using Termux. Uh, it does work. I'm quite happy with it. We're going to take a look briefly at how to use the uh, Android uh, to access <clears throat> your clipboard. And if you've seen my other videos regarding the same uh, with Termux, you'll recognize some of this stuff. Namely, you have to get the uh, Termux API, install that. Here's the link. You need to run the app update and then install the Termux API. And then from there, you need to run dpackage L Termux API. Now, control C to copy it and then control alt V to paste. Oh, and there it is. And you'll see that I'm using a touch screen. So I'm going to use the touch screen to scroll through some of this. And you'll see that we have a couple of things here like clipboard. Let's grip that. Grab clip. And you'll see that we have a clipboard get and a clipboard set. And <clears throat> we have some text here. So I'm going to use uh, some of this text here as a demonstration. So let's clear that. And just for my own sanity, let's do a a little bit of, uh, well, history. In this case, I'm going to use this command here. So I'm going to use the, I'm going to copy this text here. Control C. And now I'm going to run command 100. So asterisk 100, and that's going to run the command. And now it's done. Now the next command is, we'll go ahead and type this one, echo. You need to use the quotation marks and then dollar sign veg sort. And you should get carrots, apples, broccoli, potatoes. Carrots, apple, broccoli, potatoes. Very good, right? We're happy about that. Now, let's sort that. So I'm going to pipe it and sort it. And you see that they are now A, B, C, P. They are sorted. Isn't that nice? Now, <clears throat> if you forget to use the quotation marks, you might get a different result. It doesn't, uh, it doesn't sort it carrots, apples, broccoli. So if you don't use the quotation marks, you get a different result. If you use the quotation marks, you get what you expect. Now it gets even more interesting. If you are familiar with this problem, you'll recognize it immediately. I'm going to go ahead and copy just this text here, broccoli, potatoes, oranges. Actually, let's copy this text here. Potatoes, oranges, figs. Now I go up and I'm just going to replace whatever is in the clipboard get, enter, and now it's there. And we echo what is in there, echo veg sort, and you see potato, oranges, figs. We're very happy about that. Let's go ahead and now sort it. What do you think is going to happen? Hmm, potatoes, figs, oranges. Well, P normally comes before F, but with uh, bash, the capital letter means something. So let's do that whole thing again. And let's select all of this text, Control C. And we'll load it into the clipboard and it's loaded. And let's echo out what it has inside. Okay, it's got the entire text. We're happy about that. And now let's sort it. Now it has sorted correctly. Apples, broccoli, carrots, potatoes, figs, oranges. Because again, case sensitivity in this, sen in this 
line or these lines, capital A comes first, lowercase f comes after capital P because lowercase f is not as important or it does not fit the sort. So let's go ahead just for giggles. Uh, we'll see, apples can be red. Broccoli is usually green. Potatoes come in all colors. Ah, we don't want to do that. Control Z. And now let's copy this. Ah, let's try figs. Um, figs in spring are nice. Copy all of that. Copy. And let's load it into our clipboard. It's got it in the clipboard. Let's echo it out. And you see it's all there. And now let's echo out the sort. Let's echo out the sort. And <clears throat> because I copied it line by line, you'll see that the text came out line by line, which I'm very happy with. To close this out, we'll do one more. We'll do one more little uh, bit for you, and that'll be a word count. And word count should count the number of words in all these lines. And it does. There are six lines, 20 words, and 113 characters. One, two, three, four, five, six lines, and 20 words with 113 characters, including white space, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, uh, so this is uh, something you should know about with the command line, uh, especially using the uh, the command termux get, and this is where termux fails completely. I cannot copy and paste this text uh, from the command line. I I can hold down the screen, and then if I'm lucky, it will select the text I want, which is often not the case. Copy that. There's the command, Termux clipboard git. I hope this has been useful for you. I have definitely learned quite a bit in this process. Uh, please leave any comments, questions, uh, and happy computing.